Hey everyone, it's Robin. It's Monday, August 22nd, and I just went to CVS and I wanted to post some of the amazing deals that are there this week. I ended up saving, it said $108, and I had a 92% savings, which actually it works out to be almost more than that. But anyway, I wanted to tell you about some quick deals that you guys can get. Um, the first one is the Arm & Hammer laundry detergent. This is $7.49 usually at CVS, but we would never pay $7.49. So it's on sale this week for $1.99. And then there's an app for your phone called Checkout 51. It's a great savings app. And all you do basically is put your receipt in when you go shopping and sometimes they ask for the barcode of the product and they give you a credit back and once you get twenty dollars you can take it out or do whatever you want and let it accumulate so this week on checkout 51 you can buy this Arm & Hammer detergent it has to be the sensitive free one um, there's an orangey type yellowish container with the regular one of the Arm and & Hammer and that one is not the one that you get the rebate on. So if you go to CVS, make sure you buy the one in the white container. It's on sale for $1.99 and then when you submit the rebate to check out 51, you get a dollar back and they allow a, they allow you to do this five times. So there's a limit of five. So you pay $10 for the detergent and then you get a $5 credit back. So for five bottles of detergent, it only costs five dollars. So, but actually 99 cents a container. So that's a really great deal, and you don't even need coupons for that. Then the other one I want to tell you about is the Finish Dish Liquid. I was in desperate need of this. Um, this is on sale this week at CVS. Buy one get one 50% off. The normal price on this is 5.99. There's a $2 coupon on each one that you can get from the Red Plum of this past Sunday, $8.21, uh, for $2 off each one. Even though you're getting one 50% off, you're still purchasing two, so you can use two coupons. So this would be $5.99 for the first one, and then $3 for the second one. So you pay $9, you get back 4 which is pretty good. So you end up paying $5 for two of them. And then I also had a personal coupon from the CVS machine, and it was $1.50 off any dishwashing liquid or dishwashing soap. So I only ended up paying $3.50 for two boxes that normally sell for $5.99. So that was a great deal. The other one is the Dial Hand Soap, and these are great. I mean, I'm very into hand soap. <laughs> I must wash my hands 50 times a day. But these are on sale this week at CVS, and there's an extra buck reward if you buy them. So they are, let's see, how much are they? They are two for four. So they're $2 each. There is a dollar off one coupon in the red plum from 87. So if you buy two, it's four dollars. Then you can use actually the coupon's a dollar off two. I'm sorry. So it's four dollars. So it brings it down to three dollars and then you get a dollar extra buck. So it brings it to two dollars. So these end up being a dollar a piece. You can do it twice so you can buy four of them. So you pay you end up in the end paying four dollars for four a dollar a piece which is awesome so that is for those then Skippy peanut butter peanut butter is so much I don't even know why it is but this is on sale this week um, this container here at my CVS is three fifty nine it's on sale this week two dollars each or two for four. There's a 55 cent off 
two coupon on coupons.com that you can print out. So you end up getting it for a dollar seventy-five. So that's pretty good for peanut butter because we go through peanut butter like crazy in my house. The other thing that was kind of cool that I did buy, um, this Garnier Whole Blend Shampoo, it smells so good. And there's a $2 coupon in the Red Plum from 8-7 off of one of these um, shampoos. There's also a extra buck that you get for $2? No, $1, I'm sorry. So the shampoo, I thought it was a little bit pricey compared to Rite Aid. At Rite Aid, it's usually, I want to say like $4.29 or just about $4.29. And it was $5.29 at my Rite Aid, at my CVS. So you get a $2 coupon minus a dollar, so it ends up being three four um, two forty nine. But they had a coupon on it that you can get a free Shutterfly photo book, and I have Shutterfly, so I figured I might as well get it. The next thing is the Suave shampoo. Love this one, the Keratin treatment. It's on sale three. <laughs> that is too funny. Every time I make a video, my dog comes and gets a drink. She's in here. <laughs> Anyhow, the Suave is on sale two for six. There's a $3 off two coupon in the Red Plum from 8-7, and you get a dollar extra buck when you buy that. So that was a good thing. The other thing is, which I've been very interested in trying because I just think it's so pretty, L'Oreal has this lip palette. It's $15.79 at my Rite Aid, I'm sorry, my CVS. So there's a $3 coupon from the Red Plum 87, and I also found a $3 off 15 purchase coupon, a personal coupon from CVS. So right there, it took it down $6, so it made it $10. Well, if you spend $15 on L'Oreal, you get a $5 extra buck. So it ended up being $5, and then you get a $3 rebate from the Ibotta app. So it ended up being $2. Love it, love it, love it. The other thing I had was I had a five off 15 for Revlon um, ones. This is a personal coupon too that was just in, in my stuff. So they're not on sale, there's no extra bucks, but I thought this eyeshadow would be good for my youngest daughter. And this one, I had the $5 off 15. So I thought that was pretty good. Actually, no, I'm wrong. The Revlon Cosmetics, I had the $5 off 15 personalized coupon. And you get $4 back in extra bucks. Um, so that was a great deal. So all in all, I ended up spending out of pocket ten twenty seven. I got three dollars back from my bought and five dollars back from checkout fifty one. So I spent two dollars and twenty seven cents. I also got fourteen dollars to use in extra bucks again. Um, the reason I did this all in one transaction was I went and bought that lip um, tooth whitening, and I got twenty dollars in extra bucks for buying it. And it ended up costing me about $14. And then I got the 20 in the extra bucks. But on the bottom of my receipt, I got a printable coupon, well, printed out, for $10 off $60 purchase. So what I did is when I went and bought all this stuff, it came out to, um, after my CVS card was scanned, it came out to $78. So I used my $10 off 60 right away before anything. Then I used my coupons for my regular coupons. Then I used the CVS personalized coupons. So I used that $20 in extra bucks that I got back. Whoops. Where doesn't, why doesn't it show? Oh, there it is. $20 manufacturer. 
So I used the 20 and then I used two fives. I had a beauty one for $5 and I had another extra buck from a week ago for $5. So all in all, this is a pretty great deal and I really didn't spend much money. Um, maybe $10, not even sure. But it was a great, great shopping spree. Or shopping trip, I should say. Anyway, have a great day. If you have any questions, just hit me up on my Robin's Deals page. Okay, have a great day. Bye.